last month she came and helped me kind of produce the you know some of the the vocals and the words and just tighten up the loose ends as Alan Mulder was starting to mix the record. So, so. you weren't completely lonely. You did have a, no, a little bit of a helping lonely, hand yeah. here and there. And while you did not uh, uh, collaborate with Maynard James Keenan, you did collaborate with a Keenan on this disc as well. Do you want to tell that story? Yeah, somehow his sperm was involved with this project. <laughs> um, yeah, his son Devo was over at our house one night having dinner and brought his cello. I guess he just came from like practice or something, and it's like, wow, he's pretty good. We should get, you know. Devo to play on the record, so he played on the uh, song called "Sword." He played very good. This record's great. Man, it was he was cool with that. He was like, "Listen, you know, uh, it's it's my offspring. I'm gonna need a little bit of cash for this. You know, you gotta you gotta get 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 the kid a little yeah, bit of cash." Yeah, he got a vig. Yeah. <laughs> and then uh, uh, Matt Skiba from Alkaline Trio helped me with a song called "The Prey." He was you know helped me. He was my my lyric editor on that. It's six pages of lyrics and helped me thin that thing down to a tolerable length. Now, will any of these collaborators be coming out on the road with you when you finally tour with Ashes Divide? Mm, not in permanence, maybe, you know. Maybe here and there. Thing. Yeah, yeah, maybe for here and there. Yeah. I'm putting together a live band in L.A. kind of as we speak over the phone. So. You're doing the promo thing all by yourself. I mean, you've got Adam helping you out here, too, but, I mean, this is kind of like a, uh, a one-man thing, the big, uh, the big push, which is different. I remember meeting you for the first time uh, for the first day PC album in 2000, and... Uh, you, they're working you pretty hard for that. Yeah. Extra hard. I remember sitting down in a room with you and, and Maynard, and uh, Maynard didn't want to have anything to do with the interview. It was pretty much all on your shoulders. He's this new guy in this new band. He's got the you know the marquee name there, but uh, Maynard didn't seem it, 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 at least. I found uh, interviewing you in the past is a little easier than the interviewing. I think Maynard he either. does more than people uh, say. He might he might have an off day here or there, but um, he did a lot of press for APC. I probably did the lion's share of it, but yeah. yeah. But th- yeah, this is. Uh, this is I'm um, sweeping the floors and writing the songs and cooking <laughs> the pasta. Well, no, now you got Maynard's kid, so you can make little Devo sweep the floors, man. He's got to yeah. he's got to earn his stripes somehow, right? Yeah, I sweep his floor. <laughs> uh, it's uh, Ashes Divide, Billy Howardell in the WBCN studio, and you did. Uh, we would like to play another song before we wrap up, if that's all right. Yeah. Would you uh, Would you be ready to go? Yeah. Uh, all right. Give me uh, Give me a minute. Let me tune up and. I'll do it. Take a moment, tune up, and do it. And in the meantime, I'll let everyone know that they can uh, pick up the disc on April eighth. Uh, the new Ashes Divide disc is out April 8th. You can pick it up then. And, of course, uh, the video coming soon uh, straight from, uh, well, I don't know. I guess if we can find some way to hack into uh, Billy's iPhone, then we can, uh, you know, upload it onto our website. Of course, we're not going to do that to you, Billy. It's He's Ashes right. Divide. It's uh, Billy Howardell in studio uh, with Adam and Monroe helping out on keyboards. And uh, this song is what Forever Can Be is the second one you're going to play? Yeah. Excellent. On WBCN. i 
Excellent. Ashes Divide Forever Can Be, live in the WBCN studios. Uh, Billy Howard, uh, Adam Monroe, thank you very much uh, for coming in to perform today. I also want to thank uh, Don and uh, for helping set up, and Scott, who has done an excellent job engineering. Uh, thanks to Roger and Adam and Graham for uh, uh, documenting it all, and uh, hopefully you'll be seeing it soon on WBCN.com, or maybe you're looking at it right now.